Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to my channel. If you're brand new to my channel, my name is Elizabeth. My channel name is Tritown Girl. I hope everyone is doing well. I know I've been missing in action again, but for those of you that follow my channel, um, know that uh, Grandpa's not been very well lately, and um, it consumes a lot of my time between doctor's appointments and... Um, Unfortunately, we have found out that there is cancer in more than one place. Um, so we're just entering into that now. Um, <coughs> unfortunately, between doctor's appointments and being in and out of the hospital, things have been really, really hectic. Okay, so what I have for you today is kind of like a medium sized haul from Dollar General. It is all Christmas items. Um, I actually have not been to Dollar Tree at all this past week. Um, maybe tonight. We'll see how the weather goes. It's chilly here. I actually have two shirts. I have a sweatshirt and a t-shirt on because I'm just cold. You know, you get that cold and you just can't warm up. Um, we had a little bit of snow. You really can't see much of anything anymore, at least probably through the window anyways. Um, but that's what you get. It's the end of November. I can't believe tomorrow's December 1st already crazy absolutely crazy okay so dollar general haul um and that's too crazy you know i got a little bag of treats here so let me start off with these i thought were just so cute and dollar tree has been really giving um dollar general just a book all of them together a run for their money i mean some people say go to dollar general some people say go to just a buck some people say go to Target, go to Walmart. Everybody seems to have dollar sections everywhere. And for those of you that aren't in my area for New York State, I know all the Dollar Trees are changing next week. Everything will be a dollar 25. So mm, we'll go, we'll see what happens. All right, so Dollar General. These were $2 and they measure six feet in length. This first one, look at all the gnomies. Oh, are they just adorable? And if you don't wanna use this for garland, then just take the little rope off and use each individual one as an ornament and hang those on your tree. So just different examples. So that was $2. And then this one I thought was really cute too. It's also six feet in length and it's like little light bulbs. <laughs> I just thought it was something cute like to put over a hot cocoa bar or um, something small like a mantel piece or if you don't have a lot of room, you know, you can always fold this in half and make it three feet if you can't use the whole six feet, but I thought they were cute. I also grabbed, I got two of these actually because I'm gonna use one for friend mail, but uh, this was a dollar and it's a Nomi squishy toy. Can you believe that? Oh my gosh. Let me open it up and share it with all of you. I have never seen a Nomi squishy toy ever. So this was a first for me. So it measures five inches in length. Whoops, I just got him dirty. There he is. Oh, isn't that just so cute? And let me see how, oh, that's a pretty squishy one there. So it's obviously slow rising, but isn't that adorable? How cute is that? And I mean, for the dollar, you really can't beat it. Anybody that knows me knows that I am a Pez fanatic. I have been since I was a little kid. And um, up until probably just recently, um, I took one of my Pez machines out of my purse because I'm just one of those whack jobs that'll be like, hey, you want a Pez? <laughs> because that's me. Anyways, every year I always look for the different collectible ones, whether it's at Christmas time or holiday time, whatever. And I found two new ones that I hadn't ever seen before. So this one here, you get two packages of candy with it. And one of the candies is sugar cookie, which is a flavor that only comes out like around Christmas time. But this was a new guy I hadn't seen before, which is the Pez and it's an elf, which, and look at his little ears. Those are so cute. So I got the elf and then this one I had never seen before, and I don't know if it's new or not, so don't hold me to that, but it's a gingerbread man. They were two for $3. I was like, that's a good deal, two for $3. So I got the gingerbread man as well. So the gingerbread man and the elf. And then I was like, okay, well, I'm gonna need more than just the Pez that's there. So I picked up a refillable pack, and this was $1.50 as well, two for $3. So I picked up a refillable pack of Pez, and this has two lemon, two strawberries, 
and two sugar cookies. Grape is my favorite flavor though. I thought these would be perfect. Like if you were doing a hot cocoa bar or a gingerbread theme or a tiered tray, there's so many things you can do with this. These were a dollar each and it's a metal tin, but it's in the shape of a gingerbread house. How cute is that? You could use it as, you know, you could put a gift card in there if you want or some chocolates or something, um, or just use it for decorative purposes. So I grabbed a couple of them because I thought how cute are these to put like in a display with the gingerbread thing. They really have some cute stuff at Dollar General. They really, really do. All right, this I saw. Hold on, I'm digging, I'm digging. Okay, bear with me. Where is it? Where is it? Hold on. Okay. Sorry about that. I'm very unorganized here because I just grabbed the bag and I said, you know what? I didn't get home till really late last night, so I didn't have a chance to film. And I was like, I need to get on film like right away. <clears throat> okay. These I thought were just fun and cute. You get four in a package and they're technically, well, the bag says they're hair bands, but you know what? I use these for bracelets around the holidays. You get a green one, a red one, a silver and a gold one. It's fun. I mean, I ain't no Barbie doll by any means, but to me, if I put these in my hair, it's like putting a phone cord in your hair. It's going to just be all over the place. But, you know, for those of you that know me, I ain't no Barbie doll. I ain't no size two, but I can work it, work it just like those girls do. Okay. Little bag and trainer there. All right. Anyways, <laughs> so there's the green one and you can wear all of them at once if you want, or just a pick a color. Um, I guess you could put them in your hair if you don't mind getting your hair tangled, but I don't want to deal with that. That's just me. All right. These are adorable. Now, these I'm thinking are also a perfect accessory to these tins. They're not exact, but I thought they were close enough. And what this is, this ornament was $1. How adorable is that? So let me take it off the string so I can show you. thought I could just open it up, but okay. bear with me, keeping it live. I got a cup of coffee here, so I don't want to wing a staple across the room or let alone in my cup of coffee. Now I just lost the staple. Oh no, there it is. Okay. Especially with me around, don't want her eating anything she shouldn't be eating. Okay. Is that just adorable or what? You have these little beads. And then this sign is actually a metal sign. Perfect for a tear tray, perfect for a hot cocoa bar. And it's not identical, but I thought the little houses were sure close enough to match each other. This measures five and a half inches by four and a half inches. I mean, is that just too cute? Love it, love it, love it. So I also got another one for part of the giveaway. I came across some new stickers. These are pop-up stickers. You get 30 in a package. They were $1 each. Did I say how much the ornaments were? They were $1 each. There's these. I'm gonna try to get the glare off for you because I know the sun is shining in there. It's like a sun, but a fake sun. Um, I It's just very cloudy out. It looks like it's gonna snow again. So here are all these little snowmen and, um, yeah, snowflakes. <laughs> I really am tired. It's been a long night. All right, the next one is all about Santa Claus. This one has 30 in a package as well. And there's Santa Claus and Christmas trees and the reindeers. I hope you can see them. And then this one, I'm guilty. I got three. And the reason why is because there's no me's. <laughs> this one, you get 30 in a package. Look at these guys. Actually, I have two of these. So let me put them together because maybe it'll be easier for you to see. Okay. So there you oh, are. Are they just too cute? And then look at your little um, nutcracker dudes. Look at the little gnomies. I thought they were absolutely adorable. Never seen Nomi stickers like this before, let alone 
Um, I've never seen them at Dollar Tree, but Dollar General really has been stepping up the game. So, yeah, I got a couple of those. Also, just all about them gnomies, all about them gnomies. This, you get 16 in a package, and these were $1. And these say, be gnomes if you've been bad or good. <laughs> Again, 16 in a package. And then they had these plates that match. They had the big plate. You get eight in a package for a dollar. And then they had the smaller plate. You get eight in a package for a dollar. It's like all about the gnomes. So this all matches perfectly. I was so happy I went in when I did because gnome stuff just flies. It really does. They also had, and I got two packs of these, they had these matching cups. And there they are. Are those just too cute? I mean, this is something like you could stock up on your hot cocoa bar. Um, there's just so many different things that you can do. <coughs> Excuse me, furball. I need a sip of my coffee. I'm drinking out of the one, one of the mugs that Miss Linda had given to me. I'm going to switch over to Christmas mugs tomorrow or tonight at midnight. All right. I just have a couple more things to share with all of you. And that's going to wrap up Dollar General. Okay. They had these little guys, which were a dollar each. Let me fix them up. They're a little bit, um, they need a little love and care. Look. Oh, these are perfect for a tiered tray. The reason I say that is because they're not really, really big. This one measures six inches. So, you know, that's not like super, super big. He needs a little bit of love because they're all like tossed in the bag. But they had this design here with the holly berry. They had this one here. And they're all six inches. They had, whoops, this one's got a fur ball on it. This one's got another fur ball on it. Okay, there's that one with the holly berry. Again, they're all six inches. They were a dollar each. And last but not least, this guy right here. Of course, we need to fix his beard and everything. How cute, right? And like I said, what's perfect about them is they're the perfect size for tiered trays. Um, actually, let me see if I can, hold on, bear with me one second. Oh, you guys are gonna see some booty booty. Okay, so here's an example. So like, here's one of my three tier trays, which is a little, you know, it's dusty, I need to clean it off. But just as an example, so, tier trays for a lot of you um, that have texted me or emailed and said, you know, I'm really intimidated by a tier tray. I don't even know where to start. Really, there's no rhyme or reason to it. Just put a piece on and just keep on going, really. Um, once you put a couple pieces on, you rearrange it a half a dozen times, and then you, you're like, okay, that looks good. The next day, you can change it again if you want to. But my example here just being, and I grabbed a black tray. I have white ones up there too, but these are just the perfect size and what I mean by that is just see how nice they fit you don't want something that's really tall like if I took here's just I haven't shared this with you yet but here's a gnome that I got from this was Hobby Lobby I love it it's absolutely adorable I wish I could have bought a case of them but this was the only one on the whole shelf I love it but if I put it on a tier see how I mean it's really hard to get anything going on here unless I was to put it on the very, very top, which I could do. But these ones here, they're just small. They have beans in their butt, so they'll sit wherever you put them. Um, but just to give you guys an example of what we're talking about as far as tiered trays go, don't be intimidated by them. They're super simple, they're super easy, and once you do your first one, you'll keep going and going and going. All right, that's gonna wrap up this haul from Dollar General. And I have some other hauls I want to catch up with today. So there's going to be a couple products review. And then I received some Happy Mail Christmas Mail. OMG. 
let's just say it's a good day to wear my Snoop shirt. Until next time, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up. There's also going to be an announcement today for the winner of one of the Christmas boxes. Bye for now, everyone. Thanks so much for watching.